I see some major things happening inside of the next six month, months. Giving all praise to you. I don't know. I don't know how long this video is going to be, but let's see where the spirit takes me. It might be quick and short, but if it is, I'll come back in a little while and put up a, another video based upon how the spirit hits me. But anyway, I started watching this video. I can't say too much about it. What I'm going to do is I'll leave it in either the description box of this video that you're looking at right now or the previous video. Um, but I want you to watch it. I didn't even watch the whole thing. And um, it's going to say a lot about what we've been saying. And uh, one person came to mind, General Johanna. He had made a statement. You know what I'm, what I'm getting at? He said, I'll take three, three, four of them bad boys, which lead me to believe that he's an insider. Um, but you got to watch this video. You got to watch this video. You got to watch this video. Bombshell. Okay. Um, so let's go from here to, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go through two chapters, which you all, all should be familiar with. Um, Psalms 64. And Psalms 10, and I'll see where the spirit takes me. Prayer for deliverance from secret enemies. So we know what the secret represents, right? The illuminated ones. Hear my vo voice, O Yahweh, and my prayer preserve me, preserve my life from fear of the enemy, the ultimate enemy. Hide me from the secret counsel of the wicked. We know who the, the secret counsel of the wicked is from the insurrection of the workers of iniquity. Now, insurrection, uh, to be in something or someone and uh, uh, surrect to, be, to, uh, to, cut, to cut from within. You have infiltrators in all of the camps. So you gotta, you gotta you know, keep your eyes on everybody. It said, hide me from the secret counsel of the wicked, from the insurrection, the one that will cut from within the infiltrator, infiltrators of the workers of iniquity. It said, who wet, now wet means sharpen their tongue like a sword and bend their bows to shoot the arrows, even better, bitter words. This thing that's been going on for the last two, two and a half years, that's this right here, bitter, even bitter words. They talk, they talk about it before they do it. That they may shoot in secret at the perfect. The perfect are the Israelites, starting with the elect. Suddenly, do they shoot at him and fear not because they have an agenda. They encourage themselves in an evil matter. They consume, they commune of uh, laying snares privately, traps. They say, who shall see them? That's why when you teach, just teach. Go into the scriptures and teach. You make a statement. You have a precept, two or three, to back up the statement that you made. Or you have some documents. And, and those documents, no, no matter what subject you're speaking on, has to be filtered through the scriptures. Everything has to be filtered through the word of the Most High. They, it's, not, it's not your personal show. It's the most, it's Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shai's show. You merely work for Yahweh Shai. 
They search out iniquities. They accomplish a diligent search. So they know everything. They know everything. They know everything about the hit. They know who we are. They, they know who they are. They know where Babylon is. They know what's going to happen to Babylon. They know what their future is. They know what our future is. They know that the saints of the Most High shall take the kingdom and possess the kingdom forever, even forever and forever. Because we're going to be under the orders of Yahweh Basham al Shai. It said they search out iniquities, wickedness. They accomplish a diligent search. Both the inward thought of every one of them and the, and the heart is deep. The, the, the elites, the super elite, they're not shallow people. They're, they, they're, they're called bohemians. They, they are above, they don't celebrate Christmas and New Year's and all that nonsense. They know that's, that's, that's for the, the, the lower people. They, when they celebrate, they celebrate the, the spiritual demon Satan. But the Most High shall shoot at, at them with an arrow suddenly shall they be wounded. So they shall make their own tongue to fall upon themselves. And we know what that means. All that see them shall flee away. So when people start to realize that this was nothing but a series of uh, events that were planned, as Anthony J. Hilda would say, it was planned that way. You read that again. So they shall make their own tongue to fall upon themselves. The people that give us this information about the super elite are people that were a part of their circle. All that see them shall flee away. So when you see that this is all uh, planned, that this is all uh, orchestrated behind the scenes, then you're not going to believe it anymore they just i just heard in the news one of these news outlets on the, on the, on the radio I was in the car that um biden called for the school in texas to be demolished and to have a new building built there because of so many deaths now what do you think the first thing that came to my mind It says a verse, so they shall make their own tongue to fall upon themselves. All that see them shall flee away. This is why you have certain people that's not going to take the, um, the jump shot. And others are be willing to take the jump shot. But you got to see the video that I, when I open up this uh, video, the first thing that I spoke about, see the video. And then think about General Yohanna, what he said. Who's this, like a year, a year, a year and change ago? And he was called out for it. But the, the simple believeth every word. You know, you got a lot of simpletons in Israel. You got a lot of guys in Israel that will point to a guy, that's a leader, I'm going to follow him. I don't give a damn what he says. I don't give a damn what he tells me to do. I'm just going to do it because he's the vicar of God. And a lot of you are going to get caught out there, especially when they set up those Karagma stations. In another day and a half, it's June. It's June. Well, he's going to change his tune. If he don't change his tune, He's going to cause a lot of people to be destroyed. He's going to cause a lot of those zombies to be destroyed. And I pray that the Most High take that zombie spell off those niggas. It says, and all men shall fear and shall declare the work of the Most High. So more, more people are going to come to, to the Most High, the true power, the true Most High. A lot of these churches, these church members, they're, they're doing window shopping, man, because you know what they, you know what they notice? They notice that uh, 
the Israelites go into the scriptures. They stay, every, anything that we say, we're known for this. We go into, we go into a precept. We precept, we, we precept that. We precept it. This guy, Tony Haven, or whatever his name is, he puts up a lot of the videos of, uh, of uh, this guy. Um, damn, I can't even think of his name. The guy that sounds like Sergeant Waters, um, Gino Jennings. And he put up a video uh, that, that, as a matter of fact, you know what? Let me read this out. Let me go get it. It said, and all men shall fear and shall declare the work of the Most High. So more of our people are going to come out, of, come out of that madness, come out of that comatose state. For they shall wisely consider of his doing. They're going to consider it. They're going to use their brain. They're going to stop being a zombie. And they're going to wisely consider things. And they're going to come to the realization that the Israelites are always right. The righteous shall be glad. We know who the righteous are. In Yahweh, and shall trust in him and all the upright, the elect in heart shall what? Glory. So let me go see if I can find this video. Bear with me for a minute. Okay, this was uh, put up by Amawan I'm Gabar. Hope I said his name right. I'm not good with names. Which is uh, YouTube handle is GMS Awakening 144. Uh, uh, the, the N. And I watched part of it, but, it, but I, turned, I, I cut it off right about here because I made a video right behind it dealing with, well, I entitled it, uh, this is, we're in the time of the black, and, or the black horse, you know, Revelation chapter six. And we are in that time. Oh, let me see, uh, what was I gonna do? Oh, let me do this, let me for a minute. GMS is Rael Lights. Now you're gonna have all kind of videos coming up dealing with Israel, but nothing on GMS. Cause we're shadow band. Okay, here it is right here, kind of jumped up. This is a black Hebrew Israelite, G GMS. You notice it said GMS first, IUIC, IUCPK. Live conversation, conversations with Tony Harvin. So when you go to this video, he, he this video was put up three days ago. Now you notice the last week, about the last weekend into, into this, yeah. Over the weekend, talking about maybe five days ago, a week ago, the spirit jumped on, on us to spiritually attack Geno Jennings. So this prompted this guy, was this guy puts up a lot of videos of Geno Jennings, right? And you got to listen to this guy. He's on a real low level. So we, I'm not even mad at the guy. He's just on, he's under, he's under zombie spell up under um, Geno Jennings. You know, Geno Jen Jennings knows precepts, but his followers, they don't know shit. And when you watch this video, you're gonna see that. He, he's just under this spell. The most high got his, uh, his head locked. You know, his, he, he, get, he has, uh, you know, blinders on him. He can't hear, he can't see, he can't see the truth. Because a couple of times, he said, not all the camps are bad, but some of them, they bad, they disrespect the white man. He's completely lost. And like I said, I'm not mad at this man. 
because he, 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 first of all, he didn't quote one scripture. He might have quoted one scripture inside of an hour and 18 minutes. The people on the comment section, I don't think quoted one, maybe one scripture after maybe 30 uh, comments. So the, the bottom line is these people don't know the scriptures. They don't understand the scriptures at all, point blank period. Now he speaks about hell, doesn't even know what hell is all about because he's following Geno Jennings and Geno Jennings, he always says that you can go to, you can, you can go to hell. If you want to do that, you can go, you can wind up going to hell. Well, hell is the grave. It's not a place that you burn forever because you don't study, you don't go into, and I use this term quite a bit, hermeneutics. Hermeneutics is, is not a so-called biblical uh, term or a, that's not necessarily a theological terminology. It simply means etymon or etymology. It simply means interpretation by way of uh, going to the root of something, going to the root word of something. You can understand a lot of things in the scriptures by going to the root word. Okay, look, this comes up, and anytime we come up, there's always something negative. The rape doctrine explained, and this was put up that 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 alien, uh, K Dub. He looks um, uh, K K Dub. What's his name? K Dub Two or K Dub Rule or whatever. It is. He looks like a black alien. They can't. The the, the, the man the, the man spit fire worse than vocab. He did this one rap where he's spitting so-called Christian fire. And I put a comment there. This was years ago. I said, don't quit your <laughs> I said, don't quit your day job. And he got and he said, you don't quit your day, day job either. He got mad. You know, when you tell somebody don't quit your day job, that means what you're doing right now ain't kicking it. And these are just some of the Oh, I remember this one, GM, the Israelites, GMS member uh, killed and abandoned. We didn't abandon that brother. We got, in, we got in contact with his family and whatever type of money that they needed, they got it. And one of the guys from uh, GMS Trinidad, they left the camp and they got with um, the, uh, the IUIC. Now, this is for you brothers in Trinidad that was a part of this situation. Let me know how that guy is doing. Is he still in I IUIC? Is he still down with IUIC? Because he got caught up in his emotions. Another one, GMS, is put up seven months ago. GMS is un underrated and by far the best Hebrew Israelites. As much as uh, Captain Tazariak goes on your show, he's at your beck and call. He's a, he's a telephone, he's a, he's a smart phone call away. And he comes to your studio, y'all get together. Y'all rub elbows, y'all eat together, y'all chill together. When you need him to do a debate, he's right there. And so what does he do? He says, look, GMS by far is the best group out there. So he's saying that, uh, He's, he's, he's saying to Captain Desire that you really ain't on no level. You ain't on the, we, we're cool. I can deal with you because you work with me. He said, GMS don't want to work with me. I'm speaking in, the, in behalf of uh, uh, my main man, Frank uh, Gary. Don't let Frank come out. And now our videos start to come out. Remember this cat right here? He's still still in there. He's a, he he makes video. He's a video making machine. He came he came out to New York. There goes the devil. 
Vocab, no class, Malone. Matter of fact, let me click on it. There's all these reminders, man. You better put you better you better start putting Israelite in, in these uh in these uh, titles here because ain't nobody gonna watch your videos. The only time you get hits is when you put Israel, Hebrew Israelites, I U I C I S U P K G M S. Then you get hits. Uh oh. I might have to catch this one. BHI, which stands for uh, Black Hebrew Israelites. Role play, Black King James, UFO chariots. Anglo-Israelite Hebrew roots, more during live Q and A. He'll get a lot of, he'll get a lot of people, a lot of uh, hits, views. Cause he got Hebrew in it, you know, UFOs, Black King James. But no, no one should give this guy the time of day. Okay, bear with me for a minute. Okay, the prepared homestead, I, I um, subscribe to him so I get his notification. It says, will they come for your guns? And the answer is absolutely. Because when they declare martial law, they don't want none shooting back at them. Patrick Humphrey up, upload. They just attacked our food supply again. Prep now. So that's a new one. I gotta watch that. See these Edom, these Edomites, man. They up. They up on shit. And you know, you gotta watch, you gotta, you gotta go to, let me, uh, let me do it this way. Okay, this is uh, World Altern Alternative Media, which is uh, also known as Wham. I subscribe to this guy. He might even be a Jake. He looked like an Edomite, but he might be a Jake. He speaks a lot of truth, straight, straight to the point. Straight no chaser. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah. Yeah, this one got a bunch of hits. Caught mainly because of the title. We are in the time of the black horse and what confirmed that was um the one of the last videos i did was the uh, travis scott uh, concert that was a uh, a uh, blood sacrifice ritual and there's a video out where there's a look like a black i mean a black horse with horns jumped from out of jump from went from the fourth dimension into the third dimension and jumped over some people and then disappeared and went back into the fourth dimension. So that confirms we're in the time of the black horse. Further confirmation. 
Okay, let me do this. I'm not going to listen to this, but I was listening to this earlier. But these are the these are the uh, the other you know videos and these other sites that I've been listening to. Give you a lot of information. You get a lot of information from these Edomites. The highest will begin to visit the world, which he made. Obviously, that's a so-called UFO. Okay, let me go. This is my page. And these videos right here, if I put these on YouTube, they would, they would take my channel. These are my more controversial videos. Some of them are like re-uploads from other brothers. Like this was a re-upload from the um, from uh, Karatazar out of Vegas. I just retitled it, but it's it's a it's a straight re-up re-up. And I believe this is from him too, but I changed the title. Also another re-up. This is a good one. This is a, I forget who put this up, but I re-uploaded it five minutes long. Protest against food prices around the world. So this is not a, a United States thing. This is a world thing. This is a, this is a world event. These food prices, shortages of food. The WHO treaty is the MOTB. Oh, this was a pretty good one. More history on the one West split and other topics. And I got a whole, let me see. That's page one, page two. Oh, this one, they never did on the small hats, but in this video, you got two small hats and they say, we're gonna put the, the nations into captivity. They're gonna be our slaves. They were bred to be our slaves, but nobody has anything negative to say about that. Oh, this one check, you can check this out. A little bit more than a minute, minute and a half long. The size of the grain of rice, beware, we gave fair warning. And I also believe that was a re-upload. Another good one, food as a weapon, neural link and other topics. Anyway, with that I'm gonna say Shalom.